what's up guys so that was just my uh full body workout today saturday morning at star fitness um i tell you i'm in the worst shape i've been in in a long time but it feels good to finally be 100 uh this past year has been crazy i've not filmed a lot i did a vlog back in october about the official week one of my off season i was pretty well recovered from some nagging elbow injuries and that lasted about eight weeks before I caught COVID. And then after that, I just never could get into a rhythm. January and February were okay this year, but uh, I trained pretty high volume those months because I was doing virtual teaching and wasn't on my feet as much. Um, sitting behind a desk a lot, trying to keep up with all my messages, not just for my students, but with my online clients as well this year. I had a huge growth. It was a good year for me overall and god blessed us i mean i feel for all the families that went through hard times with this pandemic but god really blessed us and watched over us put a hedge of protection around me and my family this year and i'm thankful for that um but it, you know training wise i had a freak knee injury in march kneeling down to taking a video um for fitness compass which we now have our own youtube channel it's a little project me and a couple buddies started and um we're really excited about how it's bringing the fitness industry together. And we have a um, fitness expo here at Star Fitness in less than a month. But anyway, we uh, had that freak knee injury in March. And then in April, I had a minor surgery. And I was off the whole month of April. And May has just been getting back into it. And even today, you know, I worked out with 225. I did three sets on deadlifts with 225. I'm doing 145 on incline bench for three sets, 185 on hack squats. I'm just easing back into it. And I showed you every set, every exercise I did today. I did three sets of everything. And I tell you, I was gassed. I, I was going to do some arms, but I'm building a fence later today. I was just absolutely gassed. But, you know, I'm easing back into it. And I just wanted to make this vlog to give you an honest picture of where I am now. One year, today is one year since I did the ANBF online championship where I got first place in classic physique. And I'm not where I wanted to be a year from now. Um, I'm staying positive, at least I've been leaner than I've been in a long time in the off season. I'm injury free now at least, I'm training hard, and I've got nowhere to go but up. And by the end of the summer, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be in really good shape. I'm excited to show you, but you know, it's been, it's been a process getting through this year. It's been a tough year, but like I said, it's been a good year. God's blessed me in more ways than health um, with my business and, you know, just how my family's developing. And I'm excited um, to show you this summer and the workouts and pro progress of my online clients. I got two guys doing the NPC Battle of the River here in a few weeks. I'm going to vlog that. Um, show you also some build up to. Um, their progress and their build up to doing the show um, as well as what my other online clients are doing so stay tuned um, my YouTube channel seen some decent growth recently despite me not posting very much so I just thought I'd give you an update um, for y'all that don't know I'm all about keeping things practical for my clients um, because most people are busy I don't know too many people busier than me but I know you're out there and even if you're just normal busy, you don't need to train like an IFBB pro. It's not practical. You don't need to, you know, even if you're a pro natural bodybuilder, you don't need to give it the effort that some people give it. And when I say effort, you need to give it effort. You don't need to give it the time commitment that some people give it. It shouldn't take away from your life. It should add to it. So um, when you see me training, it's not that I train everybody like I train. This is how I train. It's how it works for me. But I take busy people's schedules you know maybe they can do several short workouts in a week they might do seven or eight workouts maybe they only need two or three longer workouts but i i make things fit to your schedule and we get results no excuses philippians 4 13 you can do all things through christ who strengthens you and if you learn that in the gym god will show you how to apply it to other areas in your life and that's what i believe that's what this brand is about i'm gonna go finish buying materials to build this fence Speaking of being busy and feed myself, we'll talk later. We'll talk later. Good chat.